Dolajai with the takeaway, up to Quincy Carrier in the orange. Right back to Dolajai, back to back buckets for the Slovakian. There's Dolajai spinning, hanging, and catches in. Marek Dolajai coming alive offensively. Buddy Beheim up to 20 points now for the Orange. Dolajai intercepts that one. Syracuse looking for some momentum. Back to Beheim. Same spot, same result. Dolajai floats it up and Gary A puts it in. That's exactly what uh, Greg Paulus wanted to see. It's a much different story than a year ago when they played for the first time in 19 years in this series, and that's an easy two. Dolajai as he found his cutting teammate Alan Griffin for two. Love his size and decision making. Dolajai against CJ Felder. Nice pass in the paint. And look out, Quincy Garrier. That was a mismatch. Tabs has eight and 11 minutes, including two threes. Newton wide open. That was easy. The high low Dolajai to Woody Newton. Uh, probably right up there, if not the uh, one of the greatest uh, Syracuse players of all time. And so I would agree. I'll give him a little credit for that one right there, that he wasn't getting the shot attempts that Buddy has had. Man, just another wide open Northeastern three attempts. Dolajai in transition. Continue to break down this zone right here. Heads up play by Griffin. We got Buffalo sporting some new uniforms, but the Q's uniforms are throwbacks. We see a backdoor cut for easy bucket for Griffin. These guys have had some success in the last three years. Now, granted, their season sh cut short last year. There's Dolajai with a left hand for his second field goal. And on the drive, there goes Graves. Can't finish it. And here are the orange in transition, and Dolajai will set it down. In the conventional setup, Bruton would have been about 10 rows back. A great find from Griffin to Dolajai running the floor once again, getting the easy dunk. Buffalo when they attack the paint. Tend to shoot. Here's Dolajai all the way back to the glass and lays it in. 15 points, 8 rebounds, but also his ability to make plays for his teammates, not only for himself. If you've got a big man, they're looking to dunk that, and not only do you get points or you get fouled by Dolezal, who's playing with four, in comparison, now you have Dolezal going down, getting the bucket. Kind of Coach Capel employs. Got to be a little upset with that, with that was. Yeah, and the way that I think about the interpretation of the rule here is Dolajai gets the bucket of the foul. The things that Jeff Capel said last year, coming off a loss to Syracuse, almost about a year ago, it was January of 2020, was that he felt like his team got shell shot. They had a quick turnaround to take on SU. They won two straight and four of their last six. Dolajai over the top of Sharp got the roll. First points for Marek Dolajai. Dayron Sharp's also returned. He had a very quiet first half because of foul trouble. Here is Sharp. Inside, up strong, had it blocked from behind by Gary. And talk about the effort right here. Dayron Sharp, I thought he had... Tony missed a couple from the line, so it stays a three-point game for Syracuse. And Dolajai off the dribble. That was magical. Allow him to be able to make a move. You and Jim Beheim think it similarly, and Dolajai banks it in. Eagle, though, Chris Mack's team has something to say about it, too. Marek Dolajai, an explosive first half. He had 11. Gerard with one, Beheim with two. Dolajai, here's the good dish and great position for Gary A. Picked up the foul. Griffin makes a pair, and it's back to a nine point game. Good defense that time by Dolajai and a nice outlet for Griffin for two. ACC opened its season with a conference game. And Syracuse scored 34 points in the loss to UVA in the Carrier Dome. Dolajai the Euro step. Twice now from the short corner. Beautiful execution. Inside, Dolajai the catch and score. So Marek Dolajai on the board. Tend to shoot for the orange. He lead by a point. Behan, Dolajai, Garrier. On with muscle, he makes up for it with IQ. Slips it, then delivers to Garrier, who punctuates the play. Clinical.
Tough pass, knocked away by Dolajan. Griffin, the crossover, and the layup. 58-33. Dolajai gets the whistle. And if you're going to look for toughness, you're going to look for 21. Dolajai to try and give you something. Great finish with the offhand there. It's an area of concern for Kevin Keats is making sure when you get a defensive stop, you finish the play. Ooh. Speaking of finishing, that's a big-time block. That game sure was. The interior passing, but that is Dolajai coming from Ooh. behind. <laughs> Aggressive with the block shot. Dolja knocking down Allen. Here's Garrier, and it may have gotten blocked partially by Thunderbird, but it had enough on it to fall in. They share it particularly well. Oh, they sure do. They do a great job with vision, eyes up, and there's another terrific pass over the top. And recently pulled down his 600th career rebound against Boston College. He did that in a victory this week. Inside yeah, the paint, drops in two. And Trey, the son of a sports reporter. His dad, Langston, writes for the Charlotte Observer. Now Syracuse grabbing the rebounding advantage. And on the offensive glass as well. Dolajai, very difficult angle. Somehow he made the shot. That cost him about two weeks of valuable practice time in the preseason. Dari Richmond in off the Syracuse bench at guard. Out the bucket for Marek Dolajai. Dolajai will have a chance for a three-point play. And I love watching Dolajai play. You're talking about a guy 6'9", 6'10", which from the point out, it was in the high 40s here yesterday. When he landed <laughs> in Syracuse, New York. Harris out of the corner. Another offensive rebound. And one of the things that Edwards does for Syracuse, he allows Marek Dolajai to go back to the wing position in the zone where he's so effective. You see Dolajai coming up with a big play already and getting Syracuse out in transition. Buddy Beheim a three. North Carolina making the change. Dolajai attacks with those four fouls. The shot clock was running out. That's Wendy's. Richmond is running around very gimpy. Gary a wide open off the field from Dolajai. And he came in banged up. And Sean, well, that can really get interesting is Richmond is the best ball handler. In the absence of Devin Daniels, he's their leading active score at 13 per game. Nice move by Dolajai. Had to adjust in the air to avoid two defenders. One of the toughest players for Syracuse, and he has shown that throughout his career. Oftentimes undersized, but never backs down. To handle the basketball and pass the ball, you see not going into danger and recognizing where the shooters are. Griffin benefits. Practice? We're practice. talking about practice? He's one for two today, so that percentage going up. Dolajai the roll, and Gerard found him for the dunk. Contribution for so many different guys, and you see the bottom guy, Cam Hayes, does not want to come over and leave Buddy Beheim wide open in the corner, giving Marek Dolajai. Syracuse with an 18 point lead, seven and a half to go. Back cut and finish by Griffin. Well, he's one of the great coaches in the country. Jim Beheim already in the Hall of Fame. Tony Bennett certainly will be someday. Dolajai, beautiful pass, and he's such a good passer as a big man. We can talk a little more about Tony Bennett's dancing, but it's Syracuse thinking about dancing right now. And Syracuse brings some pressure now. And it works. Richmond deflected Beekman's pass. Richmond lobs it up. Fuck it. They set up the full court pressure. Virginia turning it over. And if you're a Wahoo fan, you've seen this before.